let's take a quick break to hear from one of our sponsors, Love. BetterHelp. If you're searching for a therapist, you need to check out BetterHelp. BetterHelp is professional counseling done securely online. With BetterHelp, you can start communicating with your own licensed therapist through phone or video in just 48 hours, and the service is available worldwide since i know a lot of you viewers are not just based in the u.s so this is a good addition for you to know so since it doesn't matter where you are better help is there for you just visit betterhelp.com slash after the island that's better h-e-l-p to join the over 1 million people who have used better help and you can get 10 percent off your first month at betterhelp.com slash after the island that's 10 percent off your first month at betterhelp.com slash after the island we love therapy. I've been using it. I think I've really been benefiting from it. It's just really nice to be able to talk to someone that's unbiased and just tell them everything that's going on and get like a professional opinion on what you might be going through in life. I think it just really helps. Just remember, you can't love someone else until you love yourself. Our winners. I know. What the? Free. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> what the? Crazy. <laughs> All right, I'm going to intro it. We'll go right in since we, um, we're yeah, a little bit late. You Sorry, guys are you guys. So- so have a hard time. stop. Oh my god. That's dope. You guys Every- have your own podcast up and down. That's awesome. Oh yeah, we do. <laughs> we do. <laughs> Low budget. Our camera might go out for a second, but just bear with us. Yeah, we might have some tough technical difficulties but we got this all right what's up everybody welcome back to after the island i'm elizabeth i'm alex and we have olivia and Corey. Hey. our winners what's up <laughs> That's so exciting. Congrats. Yeah. How are you guys feeling? You go. I'm freaking like in shock still, honestly. Um, yeah. I mean, it's a lot to take in, as y'all know. Um, but I mean, truly, like, <laughs> it's, it's a lot. <laughs> but, like, we're so lucky, and we, the support we received is insane. Like, obviously, going to the, like, you know, we were there since day one we don't even know we didn't know anything um other people had more chance to like you know maybe look at who people were at before the show this and that we don't know anything so like coming out of the villa we're yeah. very pleased thank god we're like okay cool like but it's, um yeah. i was gonna say it's just different to get back to like the real world because i mean y'all know out of everyone like you're in there in such a secluded spot like you don't have your phone you don't know what the time it is like you're on hard chill you're on this like it says all this crazy stuff, and then immediately you just get like thrown back into the real world. So it's just weird trying to adjust and just like take everything in. But it's it's good so far. Yeah. So when did you guys? You guys got back last night, or you're not back? You're in Hawaii, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I was on Hawaii. Okay. Yeah. I am just so excited for you guys because I was literally on the edge of my seat last night. I'm not kidding. And I don't get like that, especially like for reality TV and love Island is usually pretty predictable. Yeah. I could not tell what was going to happen. I, I was like, I, Elizabeth, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it was crazy. I mean, honestly, we didn't know. Did you see our faces? We're just like, yes. You, know, like, you, you couldn't even happen. speak. You were like, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I know, and I'm like, I like to pride myself in like I'm good at communicating, and I was just like, I got nothing right now. Like, yeah, I was like, take this one away, buddy. Like, Jesus. But, um, yeah, I mean, we're so grateful. Like, this is crazy. Like, this whole experience has been amazing. I don't think it's hit me yet or any of us yet because we're still all together here in the hotel. But I think like once we all get back to our normal lives back home, they're just gonna take it in and be like, yo, that was wild. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> what the freak what the freak um where did what the freak originate from ah dang okay all right so (laughs) i just told this too but um so like growing up i i would say like what the fuck so many times like at least 30 40 times a day and then um like i don't ever like cussing in front of my parents so i like just changed i just changed to what the freak so that some reason just stuck on more than the other one. So I just been saying it since I was like twelve years old, just nonstop everywhere. And then some reason it picked up in the villa and now everyone's saying it. Because <laughs> you never would expect like this kind of guy that like, you know, portrays him as a tough man to be like, What the freak? And you're like, No, but it, it's like tattoos but no swearing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, ultimately like Oh my God. It's so funny. Did you even have a second where you thought about not sharing the money or was it just straight? You knew you were going to share it. Yeah. Yeah. It was honestly, that was probably the like easiest decision in that whole entire villa. Like 
one, she deserves it. And like, it wasn't just me winning it. It was both of us. So yeah, it, it felt right. And I don't think I could not like have done that. Like if I would have took the whole thing, I would not have been able to live with myself. So yeah, yeah. that's how it was for me. So <laughs> yeah, I, I, like I, I got over me your entire life. Like it's insane. Yeah, it's like you went in together. I yep. want to know more about how you guys got together because, like, honestly, it happened out of nowhere on TV for viewers. Yeah. So I I know that, like, uh, Olivia, you came back from Casa and you were like, wait, I think I like Corey. And Corey, when did you realize? Did you also realize in Casa? Yeah, um, it, like, prior, like, right before Casa more, like, our timelines never matched up. Like, she was working on Giovanni, trying to pursue that. And then I was on Friendship Island just, like, going through it. <laughs> and then um, <laughs> it was crazy. And then Florida came in. And I was like, oh, my God, like, finally a girl that, like, I want to pursue. So um, that I wanted to, like, put all my eggs in one basket, you know. Like, I, I never want to do the uh, 50-50 or, you know, whatever, because I've seen it doesn't work best in your best interest doing it that way. But, um. So I like a time has never matched up. And then when she went away to Casa more, I'm just sitting here thinking like, we have these five like drop dead beautiful girls, but I'm still like, I can't get her out of my, my mind, you know? And like, that's when I realized that actually there might be something there more than a friendship. And then when she came back, that's when we like hit it off. And then just seeing her come back single, I was like, no, this is it. All right. <laughs> I know it was so crazy to see it all kind of like unfold on our end and see, you know, where you guys are at now. And we're so happy for you. Do you guys have anything planned next? Like, I need to know about this Egypt, know the Egypt the trip, Egypt trip that has been promised to everybody. Corey. And like, I cannot like first <laughs> Florida, every girl. every girl was invited to Egypt, but now I'm hoping it's just <laughs> Olivia that will be going to Egypt. Wait, but... no, but... Oh, I did invite her. Corey also <laughs> invited <the> girl. <laughs> But that's in the time, like, at the end of the day, I just want, like, a girl to travel with and just, like, experience all these things. So, in the moment, yeah, it was, I was thinking, like, that's what I was going to end it with. So, I probably didn't invite her. But, um, but now, you you did. (laughs) (laughs) Well, when are you going? Uh, hopefully. So, Friday, (laughs) everyone's going to New York. I feel like you're grilling it so hard. I'm grilling you? You're like, when, when are we going? (laughs) <laughs> this is what we're doing so obviously y'all know uh, it's kind of crazy but friday we're going to new york and the whole cast is going and i think season two some people are going yeah you guys can come yeah just come there new york on friday. say less right and then after that i'm going to virginia, virginia beach and then oh, fun. Yeah, and then we're gonna just hang out there and i mean like i said he doesn't have to be anywhere right now with like job obligations and for me like probably should get back to work but i might just take a little more time off um and i know right and so we're just gonna chill vibe out for a bit probably egypt in like probably like september September, but it depends on like with covid unfortunately yeah but i hope you guys do travel because i was always bummed that that was like what i said i wanted to do with the money right off the show and like was not obviously able to make that happen but i hope you guys do take the trip and go somewhere together oh yeah. yeah I've never been out of the country, so I have to do it right now. It's you have crazy. to. Yes. Yeah. You oh, my gosh. To. I'm excited and we for want, you guys. We want, like, a full PowerPoint presentation of <laughs> all of the photos and videos yes. from Egypt once you come Literally. back. Get a GoPro. Yeah. Just make it off. Honestly, it's going to be so fun. Like, we're actually crazy together in the best way. So, like, I mean, we have the best time. Like, that's one of the biggest things, I think, with, like, my past. I've never been friends with the guy first. Um, mm-hmm. It's always just been like that initial spark and then I'm like oh it's right but like when you're friends with someone first like it's honestly I think a secret that needs to be shared more agreed I think one of the coolest things was or not coolest but full circle moments was you Olivia on the very first day responding to why you didn't want to couple up with Corey you said he looks like he'd break my heart Ah, and then now he's got your heart I know (laughs) And then this speech at the um, finale, I was like, oh my God, like, who are you? He's the best guy ever. Like, I, I mean, I don't think anyone has one bad thing to say about this kid. No, and like, Corey, you on the show was literally the funniest. Oh my gosh. Like, when you got into Casa Amor, 
you were like a kid in a candy shop. It was hilarious. hilarious. So funny. So funny. So funny. I just like, I love you so much. And Olivia, you as well. Like you killed that freaking stripper challenge. No, she did. The, that's the like, apple yeah. when you mm-hmm. threw it. Oh my gosh. And then yes. the pencil, you were like, oops. I was like, that's, that's. It was wild. <laughs> I love it. It was like, great. And I'm like, can you believe this is my first time? I was like, <laughs> we're not given like alcohol, really. Yeah. So literally we're like, so we're doing this. I know. Sober. Right. And it oh, yeah. like, in like any moment of awkwardness, you better not plan to because it's going to look stupid in front of everyone. So you just mm-hmm. literally just have to full send everything. But, oh, 100%. I went in a hot dog costume because I was like, I will not be the one. <laughs> like, I will not be the one. <laughs> um, if you're tired of always having to figure out what to eat, then you need to check out HelloFresh. HelloFresh cuts out stressful meal planning and grocery store trips. Their meal kits allow you to have dinner on the table in just about 30 minutes. Plus, the produce in their kits gets from the farm to your door in less the than a week instead of searching for fresh high quality ingredients it's simply delivered to you last night alex and i watched the finale together we did italian night so Ooh. we made pasta it was Ooh. great they gave us all the ingredients right here it had my whole apartment smelling amazing too it was like we didn't even need to have a candle because it just all smelled like italian mm-hmm. Yum, I'm Italian. and oh, yeah, yeah we'd love italian and this summer isn't over yet, so if you're looking for easy grilling, you can get HelloFresh's grilling bundles, burger packs, surf and turf packs, and more. Just go to HelloFresh.com slash AfterTheIsland14. Use code AfterTheIsland14 for up to 14 free meals plus free shipping. That's HelloFresh.com slash AfterTheIsland14. And use code AfterTheIsland14 for up to 14 free meals plus free shipping. And one more message from our sponsors, Nutrafol. Did you know that 30 million women are impacted by weaker thinning hair? If you're one of them, you're not alone, and there's a solution you can trust to deliver results, Nutrafol. The supplement supports healthy growth, healthy hair growth from within by targeting the five root causes of thinning, stress, hormones, environment, nutrition, and metabolism. I say it all the time. I love Nutrafol. Take it every morning, and I, I've actually been noticing my hair getting a little bit thicker which is very exciting because i had a traumatic hair experience a couple of years ago um but healthier hair growth takes time it could take up to three to six months to experience the change you're looking for so you can grow thicker healthier hair and support our show by going to nutrifull.com and entering the promo code after the island to save 15 dollars off your first month subscription this is their best offer anywhere and it's only available to u.s customers for a limited time plus Free shipping on every order. Get $15 off at Nutrafol.com, spelled N-U-T-R-A-F-O-L.com, promo code after the island. I think, like, one of the main questions that everyone wants to know is, what are your plans, like, for your relationship? Uh, Are you guys official? So, I want to say we're official. Um, You know, and it's it's crazy to think that it's only been legit like four like three weeks out I don't even know I say it's only been a couple of weeks that we've really been like in a romantic connection um but one thing about us like that pressure stuff like we don't want to just rush into anything kind of like our journey in the villa you know like we just took it slow started as friends and then I think that ultimately gravitated us towards each other more and we we established such a strong bond by doing that so um I feel like if we were to rush in put a title on things that might add some sort of pressure from the exterior world and, and everything like that. So just taking things day by day. I have no doubts that one day we'll get there because I vibe with this so much. So yeah, until then, just living our life. Yeah, and like I, I, love it. That, I think that like one of the best things about us, I guess, finding each other is that there was never any pressure and we actually chose each other. We didn't just like, yeah. well, we're called out from the beginning, like, I'm going to try to, you know, and that's why even with me and Giovanni at the beginning, like it was forced, I felt um, unintentionally, mm-hmm. but like, you know, I was trying, you know, and with us, it's just so easy and flowy and we're, yeah, we're lucky. Like, I honestly, like, I can't believe it. <laughs> it's so crazy it's, how it worked out for you guys. The girls know too, like, this is a different kind of experience, especially literally leaving that villa and just seeing kind of some switches in people. You're just oh, like, yeah. Dang, like, that's crazy, you know? And I'm like, and we're literally exactly the same. And I'm like, thank God. Like, you know, because, yeah, you can relate. 
Okay. Yeah. So Not too I'm, well. <laughs> yeah. But I'm like, that's like a big thing. So I was just like watching some, you know, you know, you just see people in a different light, I guess. Um, still amazing. Yeah. Don't get me wrong, but like just different. And so I'm just happy that we are vibing still so hard. And like, it's the same. That's actually such an amazing thing to touch on. Like, yeah. because that is something when you come out of the villa, you, anyone can be anywhere, anyone right. in there. Right. Because no one knows anything. You have a clean slate. So mm-hmm. I'm so happy that you guys are still as strong as you were inside of confinement. Yes. <laughs> no, <laughs> right? Two glasses of wine, confinement. <laughs> Jail. We've been making up for it since we've been here, so we're fine. Oh, as good. you should. Amazing. Amazing. <laughs> Oh, okay. So I love that you're from Alaska. Wild. Yeah. And I died at the dating story of your dad. And like, you went on an excursion with some dude and he like, couldn't keep up. And your dad was like, what the heck is Corey going to be able to keep up on these so excursions? Dead. No, literally. I don't even know what they've like put out there. So I'm like dead at that. Is, I didn't even know how they put that out there. Oh God, that poor guy. <laughs> Honestly, like literally I'll tell you later. Okay. But Corey is definitely actually you talked to my dad last night. I did. Okay, Aww. good. Yeah. yeah. Um, my dad is like the coolest, like most open, like understanding, accepting person in the world. And so is my mom. And they both are like and my mom, oh my god, we like face my mom too, bawling her eyes out, like hyperventilating. And she's like, I've only had like five glasses of wine, but I'm fine. <laughs> like love you still. But she loves Corey, and she's like, thank you for treating my daughter amazing, because she's seen me go through it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. It was actually so touching to yeah. see you talk to her on the show. Obviously, it was, like, cut down, because I know you guys had a lot more yeah. time, but I was crying. Yeah, Aww. it was hard. Your mom was like, you're not broken, and it was very, you know, empowering to see, you know, your journey, and you, you know, really find yourself and become so happy and, like, find someone that makes you feel great too and your mom saying that just like made us all so emotional oh thank you yeah that was yeah I mean it's funny all the girls and even the guys were like we're not criers we got a show like every day just crying we're like ew like, what are you doing? <laughs> but like it is what it is what am I gonna do but yeah that was a really special moment yeah it was weird too like I always talk about Christian like he was the first one to leave and I knew him for four days and when he left, like, he was the first one to leave. So, I, you know, I get the lump in your throat, like, when you're, uh-huh. like, super sad. I got that. I'm like, yo, what is happening to me? Like, I've never done, like, I haven't cried in, like, five years. But I'm literally, just, like, eyes are watering up over a guy that I just met. So, I'm like, yo, this is about to be the wildest experience ever. But it was awesome. So It is. It's so crazy. The way your emotions just fluctuate yeah. in there. And you have to make yeah. a decision just like that, just on them, which, oh, you know, sometimes isn't the best, but yeah. uh, yeah. on emotions. <laughs> yep. Give us your best three friends from the villa. Best three friends. Cash, Jeremy, Olivia. Oh, um, I would say Cash, uh, Josh. I love that you guys are best friends. Like, I know. Stop. so cute. And I really want your favorite memories, like funny ones. Yeah, yeah. like something yeah. that maybe we didn't get to see, or you know, something that just like yeah, stuck I, out to you as like a good moment. I don't know what's already been seen, but I'm just gonna say, I guess whatever. Um, yeah, yeah. funny moment. God, we had so many. I think I don't know if they showed this, but. It was, I think, like, the night or two nights before the finale. And me and Corey were just vibing because, like, you know, we were doing, like, um, just chats and stuff, whatnot. But me and Corey were on the swing. And we were just, like, cracking up. Like, he's, like, making fun of me. Like, I have this thing I laugh really hard. My forehead vein just, like, literally explodes. I don't know. I have that. And my sister does, too. It's It's not my vibe. I'm, like, in this go. (laughs) But it is. And I'm, like, laying on the couch. And, like, he's making me laugh so hard. And he's, like. What in the what in the Harry Potter is that? Like, oh my god! And then it is. Oh my god, that's hilarious! Oh my god, that's so funny. But all the time, like I wish that you guys could. I mean, you guys understand this. You probably can like relate. But I wish people could literally see every moment because no, oh, I know. We, we actually do vibe, and I don't know what's being shown, but we have the best time, you guys. It's it's amazing. Oh, I feel it through the camera. I know. Like, I I wanna, we want to come so hang out with you. Do it in New York on Friday. New York on Friday. I'm like, you guys, we're like, message us, us details. Last night. So we're like, right. So we're going, I guess. <laughs> oh 
my god we're gonna message you after this yeah we'll message you guys oh my gosh how fun it was so nice talking to you guys you guys are great congratulations Congrats! we're so happy for you (laughs) what a high in life yes you are you are just getting on the roller coaster yes be prepared oh god No, No, in an amazing way. It's going to be awesome. And we're so excited for you. I love that you even matched for this interview. So adorable. Oh, it was. We didn't even plan. That's crazy. She didn't even plan this. <laughs> Soulmates. <laughs> but oh, thank you guys so much. We appreciate yeah, thank it. Thank you. you. Everybody watching will link their socials down below so you guys can follow them and check out their stuff. But oh, thank you guys. Thank cool. you. Thank you. Good to meet you girls. Later. Okay. All right. Bye. 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 Thank you. Oh, I just pulled my back. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs>